how to use Speechify. Hello and welcome to our channel WebWiz. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use Speechify. So please watch till the end to properly understand the tutorial. So the first thing that you need to do is to open your browser and kindly go to Speechify.com or you can simply type on Google Speechify and kind of click the first link that come up and upon clicking on it, you will be directed in here. And in this website, it will show you what this platform all about. And it says here, it is the number one AI text speech reader, in which it is powered through docs, articles, PDFs, email, and anything that you read by listening with our leading AI text to speech reader. And below that, it will show you some of the features that they offer. And it says here, that it is the best AI text to speech for Chrome, iOS, Android, or MacBook. And if you want to add a Chrome extension, kind of click the hyperlink that says See Chrome Extension. While for iOS, kind of click the hyperlink that says See iOS App. And for the Android, kind of click the hyperlink that says See Android App. Well, below that, if you scroll down below, it says here that listening is better way to read. And with the help of this platform, you could get more with text to speech, in which it will help you to boost your understanding and focus, while at the same time, remember more of what you read. And aside from that, it will also help you to maximize your time, in which you can breeze through your content two to three times faster than it takes to read it. And aside from that, one of the disadvantages is you can do more at once, in which you can take your reading wherever you go, the gym, to the park or the couch and aside from that details about this platform you can also see some of the feedback or positive response from the customers about their experience in this or using this platform and you can click this arrow in order to read some of the feedback from customers and aside from that you will see below that one of the feature that it provides is to listen at any speed as it says here that our high quality ai voices can read up to 9 times faster than average reading speed, so you can learn even more in less time. While on the right side, you will see the picture or images on how to listen at any speed. And aside from those advantages, it also offers to listen on desktop or mobile devices, in which it says here that anything you've saved to your Speechify library instantly syncs across devices so you can listen to anything, anywhere, and anytime. And you'll see on the right side the preview picture of what this website looks like in any devices. And aside from that, this Speechify platform also offers to have a natural sounding human voices. As it says here that our reading voices sound more fluid and human-like than any other AI readers so you can understand and remember more, while at the same time listening to any page, in which you can use the app to snap a picture of a page in any page and hear it read out loud to you. So those are benefits that offers by this platform. And as you can see here, this platform also integrate with other social media platform, including Gmail, Messenger, Outlook, WhatsApp, Google Docs, Notion, and many more, in which these integrations is very helpful in order to access the messages, collaboration, information, and social platform. Well, if you scroll down below, it will show you the content that you must read, including the content about what is text-to-speech, text-to-speech online, what is a voiceover, and text-to-speech for this lecture. And you will see below the answers of its corresponding question. Now moving on below, you will see some of the list of human narrated audiobooks, in which by clicking on it, you can simply listening to its audio instead of reading this book. Well, below of these books, it will show you some of the frequently asked questions. And those questions including, what is the text-to-speech? How does AI text-to-speech work? How do I turn textbook into speech? In those questions below, you will see the answers on every question. And at the very bottom page, it will show you some of the company details including their products, their company, in the list of their recommended reading. And now that we explore some of the benefits, feedback, collaboration, and features that they offer, we can now proceed by exploring on the top panel. 
and those options including text-to-speech, AI voiceover, audiobooks, groups, learn, and company option. After exploring some of the options and features of this platform, we can now start creating our account. And in order to do that, kindly click the button that says try for free. And upon clicking on it, you will be directed in here. And from here, all you need to do is to click the next button. Since on this page, you will tell about yourself so this website can customize your experience. And from here, you can also choose some of the voices that you prefer, as voices are the heart of Speechify. Some of the voices including Emma, John, Mary, Sally, and many more. And from here, you can also change your accent that you prefer, such as English, British, American, Australian, Spanish, and many more. And after that, just proceed by clicking the next button. And as I said earlier, you can also change or choose your listening speed, such as if you prefer faster, average, or slower. And from here, all you need to do is to select your answer to their question, what do you do for work? as this will help them to personalize your experience. Well, for the next question, what product do you need? And you can choose either the two options, such as text-to-speech reader or voiceover studio. And just proceed by clicking the next button. And from here, it says here that you can sign up in this platform using your Google account, your Apple ID, your email address, or by typing your password. And you will see on the left side, some of the feature or benefits that they offer. And in this video, I'm gonna choose to continue with my Google account. And upon signing in, you will be directed in here. And from here, you will see the editing tools on the left side panel, such as this one. If you want to import a script or upload a files from your computer, you can proceed by clicking select a file button. And aside from that, you will also see on this left side panel that you can add your own music in which you have the two options. The first one is to choose a music from stock music in which they offer a variety of category such as characteristics, genre, instrument, mood, duration, and BPM. While the second option is to upload your own music from your computer files. And aside from that, you can also import a photos or images and videos from your computer files by clicking this button in order to import a media file. And now from here, if you don't want to import a file as your script, you can simply enter the words or context that you want. And from here, you can also choose the voices that will speak to your preferred contacts. And you will see it on the right side panel. You can select the voice under recommended in which it will show you a variety of voices such as male, female, old, young, and many more. You can also customize the speaking tones, but I'm going to choose to make it cheerful. And you can also customize its volume, pitch, and its speed if you want it to become faster, average, or slower. You can simply adjust it in this speed option. Now, if you're done editing your project, you can now proceed by clicking the export button, which is located on the top right corner. But in order to export a file, you must have a premium account in order to successfully exporting a premium feature. So that is just how to use Speechify. Thank you.